at the direction of the President of the United States, fighter aircraft assigned to U.S. Northern Command successfully took down a high-altitude airborne object off the northern coast of Alaska. A U.S. F-22 fighter jet on Friday shot down an unidentified object about the size of a small car. Flying over Alaska, the Pentagon's chief spokesperson, U.S. Brigadier General Patrick Ryder said, The aircraft that took down the object was an F-22 uh, flying out of uh, Joint Base Elmendorf in Alaska. Uh, it employed an AIM-9X uh, to, to take down the, the object. This comes less than a week after the military brought down a Chinese balloon that had flown across the United States. The object was flying at an altitude of 40,000 feet and posed a reasonable threat to the safety of civilian flight. President Joe Biden's order to shoot down the latest object was a rare presidential level of involvement, given initial accounts suggesting the object did not pose a military threat and was fairly rudimentary. But Republicans, and even some of Biden's fellow Democrats, had criticized Biden for waiting before he acted against the first balloon. White House spokesperson John Kirby on Friday declined to give a detailed description of the latest object to be shot down. Uh, we're calling this an object because that's the best description we have right now. Uh, we do not know who owns it, uh, whether it's a whether it's state owned or, or or corporate owned or privately owned. We just don't know. It, it was much much smaller than uh, the spy balloon that we took down last Saturday. Um, the way it was described to me was roughly the size of a small car. Kirby said the discovery of the new object and its track first came to U.S. attention on Thursday night. The Pentagon said, unlike the Chinese balloon, this object did not appear to be maneuverable and was at the mercy of the wind. Now, the recovery process begins. We do expect to be able to recover uh, the debris uh, since it fell not only within our territorial space, but on what we what we uh, believe is, is frozen uh, water. So uh, it, uh, a recovery effort will be made, um, and uh, uh, we're hopeful that it'll be successful, and then we can learn a little bit more about it.